back. Drivers beware. Odds of hitting wildlife increase this time of year. So the Colorado Department of Transportation doing work to help you avoid these wildlife versus vehicle encounters. Our Bill Folsom looking into how it's being done. Bill. Yeah, it may seem roads rule and they are important, but wildlife, waterways, air quality and noise all have to be factored into road projects. All are priority for CDOT's environmental team. For example, when deer or other types of wildlife are killed on a road, the CDOT cleanup is not just removal, it's documented for data. Colorado wildlife is plentiful. In certain times of year, the number killed in car collisions is higher. Right now is one of those times. They know that the season is changing, the days are becoming shorter, and so they're moving around the same time that we're doing a lot of our commuting. CDOT crews remove carcasses from roadways. Animal type and location gets recorded. CDOT environmentalists use data to identify areas where animal versus car encounters happen most often. That information is shared with traffic engineers. Devise ways or figure out, hey, this is the best place to put that underpass because we have the highest number of frequency hits in that corridor. The Gap, for example, is getting nearly a dozen strategically calculated wildlife crossing locations. Other roads get fencing, and some places, extra signs to warn drivers. Animal encounters are just one of many environmental factors impacting CDOT work. Wildlife resources, wetland resources, socioeconomic resources, people, noise. Congestion, speed, access points are factors for drivers. State and federal law require consideration of impacts along or near roads. Another wildlife example is the Migratory Bird Treaty of 1918. Certain birds nesting where CDOT work is planned can impact projects for months. CDOT has had projects where we've had to delay construction or delay methods of construction. And with our gross CDOT environmental project managers, they are very busy. Here in the southeast region, there are four. Each is doing tracking, doing and tracking environmental impacts on 35 to 40 projects. Alan?